Hey there, it's Potmos, and nice of you to join me for this brand new series with Tavern Masters. Because, well, a few updates have come out, and they really improved the game, added quite some interesting things to it. And I thought, well, for the second week with just one special game, let's play this. So let's load up a new game, and see, I probably have to go through the, um, ooh, relax, normal or hard. I will play on normal. Alright, welcome to your tavern. So, yo, uh, well, yeah, we'll have to do the tutorial again. I'm going to th go through it quite quickly because you can do this yourself if you have the game, of course. Alright, we're not going to rotate. Yeah, this is all fine. Let's fix it. Ah, we have to fix the wall. Well, that's something I know how to do. We'll have to place a door and a window. Yeah, let's buy some tables. Alright. Let's go do so. Tell me where to put it. Alright, there we are. We have to place a light, of course. Yes. Let's get beer. And buy the barrel. Refill all. Oh, we have to click it. Yeah, we did. Buy. Alright, here we go. Staff. Ah, that's some of the things they changed up. You can see here. This is pretty easy. We can hire a bartender. Five drinks, four drinks, two drinks. I think this one is pretty good. So let's hire this guy. And we need to hire a waitress. Ooh, this can carry a lot of drinks. That's really powerful. She's not so fast. We don't need speed climbing stairs, so that's perfect. So I'm going to hire Rosalyn. That's nice. Let's do some research. As we can already see, they um, changed the research tree a bit. There's all these new things in. Um, new kitchen items, new props. We even have, um, let me see, fire extinguishers. Um, because, well, there might be fires and stuff like that. So... Things are really changed up. We even have bar games at this point. Um, so yeah, let's just go ahead and keep time, get time rolling. There we go. Well, here we are. Everybody's coming in. Guests are coming in. These are the missions, of course, that we have. Let's just keep going now. Let's make some money. So this will be this week's special. Um, so I'll make five episodes at least of it that you can watch this week. I hope you'll enjoy it. And uh, when I'm back from holiday, um, I think we'll go back to the regular schedule. But we might just end up uh, getting back with this game as well. Or I might put it in a live stream. Who knows? But first, let's focus on our tavern. Now we can see all seats are taken. So maybe we should add one or two seats. Um, let's go check. An extra table costs us 70. But it's okay. We can pay for it. Yeah, this is it. So... At least now we have some extra seating so more guests can come in. We can see our waitress isn't that busy all the time. So there's plenty of time for her to bring the guests what they want. So we don't need to hire an extra waitress yet. We can see it pays off that we have the extra chairs, extra seats in. So that's worth it. Ah, we can upgrade somebody. You can upgrade Sterling. Oh, that's cool. Um, I'm going to give him... An extra drink to, to carry. I think that's good. 17.9 guests come in a day. So we can see now that we don't really need the three tables anymore. But that's okay. Um, we did need them during the day. So that's good. Of course, we really have to start off with a small tavern. So hopefully we can grow um, pretty fast. So that we can have this nice tavern and then put in all these nice things like games. We can unlock special bar games. We can have a lot of kitchen stuff. We can have some specialties like fire extinguish equipment and stuff like that. So that'll be interesting to see. Should have There should be more wallpaper and stuff in here as well. Alright, this is not that important at this point. Let's just refill everything. I always like to do that. And then start a new day. Let's try and really make some money. We want to get another set of tables. It's 70 for a table and 100 for two seats. So we need at least 170 just to get an extra seat in. And at this point, I don't really think uh, that we need that with the amount of guests that come in. We have seats for 12 guests, but they come spread out over the day. So I'm not really concerned about that right now. Although we could try, of course, to get a higher prestige. Um, and, and see 
if we can attract more guests. Now, the chair does raise prestige a little bit, so that could be something. I'm not sure if that's worth it at this point. Last day we need at least 18 to refill all this, and of course we need to pay for our salaries, which is also 16. X and oil. Oh, I guess that's for the uh, light bulbs. Yeah. Bad wax and oil quality. There's low risk of fire. Ah, we can get more expensive stuff. And we get an even lower chance of... That's really thought of. That's really cool. It'll cost you quite a bit, but you'll have a lower chance of getting into a fire. But maybe we'll have to invest something into fire putting out fires because, well, there is a chance, of course, that there will be a fire. And we wrote, yeah, we can wrote it. If we put it here, I think this is a good position. There's two extinguisher buckets. Maybe we should just place them in the corner somewhere. That they can run to. Right, we'll place it right here. I really don't want to get a fire, but a 15% chance almost that this will be in a fire, that's not good. So we really need to think about... Um, right, let's raise her tips so she'll be more happy. We need to think about fires that can be a real issue. Night time is starting. Ooh, congratulations on unlocking the kitchen. Here's another 800 bonus, so you have enough money to build it. Oh, that's interesting. So now we can build a kitchen. I think we should expand a bit then. Let's first set this up. Let's get some lemonade in. We have unlocked this one. I think, yeah, we're going to wait until the end of the day, then we're going to expand our little establishment a bit. And see if we really have the money to <laughs> get everything for the kitchen. That would be nice, of course, if we can get everything for the kitchen. But we'll have to see, I think. Alright, here comes the end of the day. And, uh, yeah, there we are. Ah, oh, we made some good money, but mostly thanks to the, um... Alright, let's expand. I'm not sure how much bigger we need to get to get the kitchen going, but we're just going to try it. Alright. Yes, that's it. We need some flooring. And I guess something like that. Or this, alright, this is good now. Let's start working on the kitchen. Now we need a counter, of course, for the kitchen. And the cooks need to be on the right side of that. Uh, let's just place it right here. Then they need plates. And of course a chest where all the stuff is kept in. That they can pick up. Alright, so now we have the kitchen. All we need to do now is hire a cook. There we have the chefs. Let's see. Well... Uh -huh. Two and a half meals per second. Well, meters, I think. Hmm. I think these two... This one is really balanced, by the way. Maybe that's a good one. Let's hire this one. And he gains experience two times faster. That's very good. I think we should also hire a new um, waitress. Just to be sure that we can get the drinks out and the food out. <laughs> Carry three drinks at the same time. Mood is not affected by cleaning. Oh, I think we should do this one. Alright. And Alyssa should be set to... At least no hotel. There we don't have any. Like this, I think. Uh, cleaning can be... Alright, so... Let's do it like this. So this one will focus on drinks, the other one will focus on the food. And that should... Oh, we, we will get more guests in this day, so let's refill. And then make sure that when we can, we'll get extra seating in as well. But this should already help us out. Ooh, let's wait a second. I think we should move this one right... Or which is... Who is which? That's the, the question. 
can't really see. That is Alyssa. Alright, she's the food one. So yeah, she's in the right corner now. She has to take orders, of course. Own four tables, own eight benches. Change the name of the tavern. Alright, we should change the name, I think. Uh, I think last time we had the Petmosia Inn, so now it's the... Um, it'll be the Petmos Bar. Something like that. Well, I, I guess what we can do is some... Um, you guys can, can just name comments, put names in the comment section, and I'll change the name eventually. Of course, I will record this five episodes before... Um, any of you will see one of them, so I can only change it after those five episodes. But just leave a name in the comment section and I will try and fix that up. Alright, here we go. We make some money. We still have free chairs. That's good. Uh, free tables, spaces. Ooh, but that's because it needs lighting. Ah, let's put in lights. We don't have money for a light. Well, that's an issue. Alright, let's save some money then. Oh, that's a problem. Ooh, I have an idea. Let's put a little wall light here. And then uh, go to seats. Place this, these seats right here. Now we have the extra seats available to us. Nice. So now we can have extra people in. Room four tables. Yes, we do. That's good. We can upgrade Frederick. Um, well, we'll just upgrade these. Bring in extra money. Ooh, we can also upgrade Sterling again. Um, let's increase his speed. Ah, and we have a research done. We can now have lemonade. And can we already pay for that? I don't think so. No, it's 200. But that's an extra drink. And all the new drinks that you unlock usually tend to bring in more money. So um, it's really interesting to get those. Because they'll just bring you some extra money that we can always use. I've never had a moment where I thought, oh, I can't use the extra money. Well, maybe in the end of the game when you really have already have everything and you can just... Um... Ooh, this is good. Now we have 200. Let's get lemonade. Lemonade. Oh, we can't refill it, but we can fill it for a bit. So that's it. That's good. Unlocked another research. Uh, yeah, let's do that. All right, well, things are running, so let's start a new day. Yeah, we'll run a slight deficit because of all the things that we have to pay for. But it'll be fine. Buy a fire extinguisher, we already have. Let's see. 48 guests a day. That should really bring in some money. Ah, we can do a lot of upgrades. They really upgrade quickly now. It'll go slower, I think, later on. The, the higher level they are, of course, the slower they'll get, but that's fine. Still, most of, our, most of our seats are occupied. I'm going to try something else. Let's move this table as well. So now this is in the light as well. So as soon as we have money for seats, we can just add seats and we can serve those extra guests. We have to keep an eye on the watch times, though, the waiting times, though. But everything seems to be fine. We can, I think, uh, house a few extra people. That shouldn't be a problem. That should really start the money flowing. Now, of course, in the beginning, that's a little bit harder than, than when, you're, when you get bigger. So now it's a little bit more of a waiting game to finally get the money that you need. But this looks good. We have a pretty full tavern. One, two, three spaces available now, but... It's because a few guests recently got out. There's more coming in again, so that's good. Meals are working out so far, although we have to refill at the end. And don't count yourself rich too soon, because, well, although this number is really running up, we also have to refill everything all the time, and that takes up quite a bit of your money. So let's take a look at this. Yeah, we can now refill it completely, but that took out all our money. So that's how fast that goes. So you really need to save up a few days if you want to have some extra money. All right, let's carry six drinks. That will go even better. You can just pour all the drinks and she can take them all at, at one go. Yeah, there she goes. Perfect. But yeah, we can see that we do make 
a better amount of money than we did before, so that's good. And the research is coming along nicely. Yep, it's done. Let's start a new one. Finish research. Oh, nice. Well, I think it's going according to plan. Yeah, we made some money, even though we did a few investments. Can we totally refill this? No. So you can see right here, if we want to get this full filled up, we need a lot of money. Now, normally you don't get it completely filled out straight away because that is very expensive. But once we have done that, it will be cheaper, of course, because they won't eat everything all the time. But now let's just start a new day. We start in the plus. That's really nice. Maybe we can do a little refill so everything is filled up. Yes, it is. And that's good. New missions, that's nice. Click on any light to find about the fire risk. Well, there it is. So that's good. We've done that mission now, so let's get this point. Well, some of the missions are really informative and, and, and let you know about things like fire risk. And... Hmm. 200 for a standing light so we can add a table here maybe we shouldn't do that but just add another wall light here and then go with a table close to the um to the table here i think if we have the money for it that should be the thing so let's first build a light right here or maybe he yeah let's put it up here that's even better and then a table. Now we'll have to wait, of course, until we have some more money. Then we can put in an extra seed again. There's still a few spaces free, so there's no need to rush the table, the seeding, but. Yeah, we only have one seed available now, so I'm going to add at least one seed. We have the money for it anyway. This is good. Well, we're totally full now. That's good. Let's get even the last seed in. Oops. Um, let's move it. Yeah, there it is. Perfect. All right. Well, this looks good. Now, now we should be making some money. It's always a bit of a trade-off. How fast do you grow? But if we grow too fast and we get too big, we need the extra waitresses that we also have to pay for. So can be something to keep in mind. Let's do the tip one. That's fine. This guy can be upgraded again. Nice. And just getting extra space here will be really expensive. So we'll have to save money for that. I really enjoy the music in this game, by the way. If you just play this, it really gives you the, the feel that you are in a medieval town running a bar. Alright, we're nearing the end of the day again. And we did good. Raven has enough time for them to clean up. Made some money, even with the purchases, so that looks, that looks very good. Let's refill some stuff. Can't completely refill this, but we yeah, we need to... Um, do some restocking. Let's get it up to 20. We can with each. Yeah, alright. So this is up. That's good. But we need a lot more money. So let's just straight up start a new day. And make sure that we can um, restock some more the next. Research is almost done. That's really good. I think in a few days we should get our first fire up. If we just take the chance, of course. It's 80.5% chance now, so that's even going up. I think with more lighting, the chance will go up, so... There's almost a 1 in 5 chance that we'll get a fire. Did we already get special guests? No, we didn't get any rare guests lately, so that's not something that we should worry about. We had 100% seat occupation on average last day, so that's really good. That's really making us the money. 
And of course, preparing meals also really helps. Not research almost yet. Yeah, there we are. Event instruction. Congratulations on unlocking the events. Here's how they work. Yeah, I know how they work. All right, so we finished the research. We now have a different floor tile, and we can do a new research. We can get the adventurers, the wine, or the fireplace grill, but we need special guests for those. So let's start with this one. We can finish that one pretty quickly, I think, because that's just normal guests, and we should get 50 on average, so that should be done maybe the next day, because this day is already going on quite a bit, but that could be interesting. Now, I'm not going to get things like the adventurers table straight away, because they're very expensive, those missions are expensive, and we really need to make some more money. But making sure that we have a working, running tavern, and slowly growing it, that could really help out. And we can still see waiting times are okay. So maybe, but just maybe, we could try and expand a bit soon. And then make sure that we hire one or two extra waitresses that can do the trick. It's also tough because we really need to make some extra money to refill this. And this, of course, but this is not going that fast. Alright, just a few more guests, waiting for them to leave. I think one of the missions is to get a ladder rug. Oh, yeah, two carpets. Alright, interesting. Though the prices are not really worth it to just invest too much in it. Alright, let's refill. And do some refilling here. Or we can buy 42. Apparently we only use wheat and fruit, so just fill these two up. That'll be interesting. That gives us plenty of um, goods that we can use. So have more than 40 customers in a day. Oh, I hope we can do that. We have five tables. A four persons each table. So... That's 20, so all seats need to be taken twice today, and we have served 40 guests. There's only 50 incoming, so that could be a challenge, but we'll see. Right, I want to use a little thing differently. I want to put this right here, so it's a bit closer to all these lighting, so as soon as a fire starts should be able to fix it. Frederick can be upgraded. Um, yeah, let's increase his uh, main course skill. Get prepare all meals. Let's take a look. We can see already that he's doing mainly desserts, by the way. So maybe we should have done that one. And we're getting close to our first upgrade. Where we get extra money for the um, things that we prepare. So that's really nice. Well, we're already in the plus again, although we did quite a bit, spent quite a bit of money on refilling this. That's nice. And we can upgrade a meal. Let's level it up. Let's make sure we make more money for that. Should we plan an event? Water, lemonade. Alright, just a regular party, 20 guests, but we need more prestige for it. We need to double our prestige, actually. So I'm going to go for the wine one, but we're not going to make that yet because we need an event for those 20 guests. So we really need to start investing in getting bigger, getting some extra prestige by decorations and stuff. But I think I want the most by just expanding our tavern a little bit. So that should be the goal. Um, increase her speed, not carrying. Now, it's costing 50 to just place one of these walls. So, it'll be 100 just to place these two. Then it'll be one 300 to... So, it'll be 400 just to place walls here. Then we'll have to remove these, which also costs a bit of money. Then we'll have to put in flooring, and then we'll have to get some chairs. So, maybe saving a bit of money for a few days might be good, and then just do the expansion. Because we don't have the money to, to do it all in one. We do make a good amount of money, though, so that's interesting. And we got the serve 40 guests, so let's just refill this, so that at least we have all the drinks. Do we need to do a refill here? 
Okay, we'll refill these two. And now let's get going with the next day, straight up. And then maybe we can expand. Could also try to expand just a little bit, make some extra money and then do it again, but not sure. And we could also expand by changing up the tables a bit so we can place more tables in here. I'll have to see about that. It's really cool because now this is some sort of a box where you can really see the stuff in there. And it used to be a chest. Let's zoom in a bit. I really like the graphics. You can really see the different types of food in there. So they worked on that. And this, this fruit bowl plate looks really cool. Here we can see this is bread. So they really did their best on the um, right graphics. That's really nice. Ooh, we can upgrade another one. Level up. We'll bring in extra money. Here comes a monk. Alright, well, this works out okay. All we need now is to start some actual growth. Now we can skip refilling the uh, bar, for instance, for a few days because we're not using that much. We can also skip refilling this every day. We can just skip a day and then use the money to try and expand as much as we can. But it's a bit of a waste of money if we can only do the outside and don't have money left for the inside. So that should be taken into consideration. Um, and that's what I'm going to do. So let's see. It's slowly coming to the end of the day. And that could be the moment where we decide on how far to expand. Let's just wait until the guests are all gone. And then we'll try and expand our um, little endeavor here. I think we have a good amount of money to, to do this in one go. And place a few extra tables. And then once we get extra money, do the rest. But not 100% sure. I'd also like to check how far we can get with the plots. All right, here we go. Let's see. Uh, there's still some room here. All right, let's build a wall, although it is expensive. Could also just go to the end here. Something like this. Place the tables in. I don't think that's really the smartest thing to do. One, two. This will cost us 300 just to close this off. So let's do that. Then... Um, let's get rid of this wall. Alright, let's do the floor. It's totally free. But now we need some lighting. Ah, the lighting just got removed. Maybe we should have removed... Give that a new place first. Alright, let's see. Let's select this whole table set and put it in in the corner up a bit like this. Yeah. Well, this creates a bunch of space. What if we put a light here? Yeah, that's good enough for those tables. Although I think we still need to get one of these eventually. Maybe just not right now. Can we place an extra table here? Yes, we can. And we can put at least one seat next to... Oh, we can do two seats. Alright, so we've got extra seating now. So let's just start a new day. We'll run a slight deficit, but we can make that up. And maybe add a few extra seats. We'll just have to keep an eye on the waiting times, because we don't want any of the people getting uh, mad because they don't get served in time. But this really is an, is, is an enlargement of the facilities that we have. That's nice. And then we just need to bring in the extra tables and, of course, some lighting, because lighting is really an issue. So I think we should really save for this one. We can see that this gives a lot of light. So we've just placed one here, and that's about it. So that's something I really want to go for. 200, but that's just giving all the light that we need. And we are ready to fight fires. 
With our two buckets here, so that should work out. Ah, another upgrade. Sterling, level 5. Well, I'll let you carry six drinks then. We can do some extra pouring. Unfortunately, we don't get any special guests in yet. That would be great if we could get a few extra in. That would slowly get us a mission. Yeah, we already got one because it was up to 20, so... Yeah, there's another one. Oh, great. So slowly they come in. So even if we don't host the event yet, because we don't have 600 prestige, there is a chance that we can... Um yeah, we're still good on the food. This is running a bit lower, but we're still fine. We can see that they're more busy now. It takes longer for them to serve everyone. So... It might be good to get an extra waitress soon, especially if we get extra tables. And I think we should get a set of extra tables. No, not yet. We should get the light. That'll be 80 prestige. That's good. I'll place it right here, I think. That should be it. We can always move it. That's giving off a lot of light. Then we can add extra seating here and then slowly go this way with the seating. And maybe hire an extra waitress soon. We're not getting close to, to people really getting mad at this point, so we can still manage. But getting some getting one extra might be helpful. Oh, refill costs only 77, so that's that's worth it. Kitchen is closed, I guess. I think we can do one more day in the kitchen without restocking, so that could be something. Right. End of the day. Yeah, oh, we still made a little bit of money, even with the purchases. Let's immediately start a new day. Only minus 72. Here comes the guests. Now, hiring an extra waitress will also help out because... If they can stay longer, they might order an extra drink. So, I'm really thinking about hiring that extra waitress soon. Now, maybe we should get a set of tables first. Just one table, two seats, and then hire an extra waitress. Alright, money's coming in slow. But it's coming in. So 70 for a table, twice 50 for the seats, so that's 170. So I guess when we're up to like 180, we'll just place an extra table set. Ooh, we can level up another piece from the menu. We can level up our cook. Let's do dessert now, so they bring in a little bit of extra money. We're getting close with the money to get the extra table set. Yes, there we are. Let's just place it right here. Well, right on time. Extra people coming in. Well, there's still a few seats open. Let's hire the extra waitress now. Let's see. Carry four drinks, four drinks, eight drinks, but she's slow. I think, yeah, I don't like the climbing stairs one. So let's take this one. Four drinks, she's pretty fast. Let's hire Helga. Um, she shouldn't be focusing on the hotel. And let's keep it like this. She can do food and drinks both. But equal importance. Oh, we already got a good amount of money again. Didn't run out of any food here. Alright, let's fill it up. That's good. So that was already a big refill in the uh, chest. So that's nice. So we can upgrade Alyssa again. Well, let's make her give extra, get extra tips. Alright, the day's over. Everybody should be leaving. And we almost made some money, even with the purchases. So that's good. 
And well, this will be the end of this day, and this will be the end of the first video. So thank you very much for watching, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. If you haven't done so, please subscribe to my channel. If you have any tips, tricks, comments, leave them in the comments section. Although, as uh, I already told you, I will record the first five episodes, so I will read it after that. Um, but no worries, still put them down and I can use them later on. And of course, I hope to see you in another video. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.